The royal dispute that complicated his sister's ceremony at the same location was on the Duke of Westminster's mind when he made the extremely sad choice to keep the Duke and Duchess of Sussex out of his wedding the following summer. Hugh Grosvenor, the Duke, was very cognizant of the tensions that surrounded Lady Tamara Grosvenor and Edward Van Cutsum's 2004 wedding at Chester Cathedral and did not wish for something similar to occur on his own. Hugh is aware of the delicate nature of wedding invitations, a family acquaintance told this newspaper. When Camilla Parker Bowles received an invitation to his sister's wedding, she was informed that she would need to sit a few rows back instead of with Prince Charles. She would also need to make her own way there. This was due to the fact that Prince Philip and Queen Elizabeth were scheduled to attend the then. It may provoke comment on the day, but Her Majesty will also be attending, and she is a stickler for protocol, a courtier from Buckingham Palace was quoted as saying at the time. Since Mrs. Parker Bowles has no official standing, it would be inappropriate for her to sit next to Prince Charles in the pew designated for the royal family members attend. Even Mrs. Parker Bowles would be given status and rights that she does not have if she were to arrive at the event with the prince in front of the queen. Very few official events in the past had both the queen and Mrs. Parker Bowles, as she was known at the time, in attendance. These included the Queen Mother's funeral at Westminster Abbey, the pop performance held in Buckingham Palace's grounds to commemorate the queen's jubilee, and the ceremony held at Westminster Abbey to honor the 50th anniversary of the Queen's coronation. Mrs. Parker Bowles was apparently so enraged to read in a newspaper diary column that royal protocol would mean she couldn't sit beside Charles at the wedding that she told the heir apparent that the status quo was no longer acceptable, according to Viscountess Banger, better known as the renowned author Sarah Bradford. Like her brother's wedding, Lady Tamara's was billed as the year's biggest society event, but she and Prince Charles decided not to go. It was stated that Charles made the choice because he didn't like how Mrs. Parker Bowles was treated. 600 people attended the wedding, including Prince Philip, Princess William, and Prince Harry. The exclusion of Prince Harry and Meghan from the Duke of Westminster's wedding coincides with a growingly acrimonious royal split. On June 7, Hugh Grosvenor, 32, and Olivia Henson, 30, will tie the knot at Chester Cathedral. Invited guests include Prince George, the Duke's godson, as well as the King, Queen, Prince, and Princess of Wales. The Duke and Harry are said to be so close that Prince Archie, Harry's son, has the Duke as his godfather. The King's godson, the Duke, is thought to be worth £10 billion, and he was present in official capacity at the coronation in May. Though he is aware that their presence could take center stage and create friction for Charles, Camilla, William, and Catherine, it is thought that he wished to extend an invitation to the Sussexes. According to a friend of William and Harry's, it's really unfortunate that this is the situation that it has come. View is one of William and Harry's very few close buddies who has continued to have a close relationship and communication channel.